happy dumb. <laughs> yeah. I'm, I'm very used to when you say, I'm going to go live, I'll make fart noises and stuff because I think it's funny. But lately you've been either not telling me or saying, I'm going live, which means I'm already live. You're welcome. <laughs> You're like a big sigh. <laughs> mm -mm. Okay, we're going to go find the fire crotch lady, right? Yeah, I'm going to go stab fire crotch. With my penis! Gross. Hi, Mom. The Firebrand's plan is coming to fruition. At long last, That's we have waited in the shadows for too long. Secured the minster. God, I love that ability even more now. Like I loved it before. Yeah. But, but now, now it's, it's like... now it's just brutal. Troubling you, father? Abbas, look, they are burning all of these passages. Why are you not stopping this? <gasps> it's her! Yeah, oh my god. Because they ordered them to. What? The vellum that burned before you are covered in lies. So long as they exist, you cannot hope to see the world the way it truly is. Lies? Abbas, what has happened to you? We are God's children all. Do not renounce him like this. Please, I beg of you. You can still repent. God will forgive you. You know he will. Your mind has been poisoned, but worry not. We have the antidote. We will set a new example to which all may aspire. You, you, you're mad. You won't get away with this. I won't let you. <clears throat> No one to tell. No one who will hear your cries. If you cannot bear to watch them burn, then you should burn with them. Wow. I want it all destroyed. Every text, every passage, every scribbled piece of paper, everything. It is time to end this. Yes. By a brand. No! <laughs> 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 the Abbess is the firebrand. She'll kill whoever stands in her way. Time I get between her and her next victim. Well, that was easy. Those three of them. all of them. Not the firebrand. Found her. <laughs> right through the back of the neck. Nice. 
This fire that burns in my heart. I've always had it. A longing to do something grand and important. But that door was always shut to me. My methods deemed too severe. I was cast out. Shunned. Scorned. But the Order, they took notice of me. Saw that it was courage that drove me. Courage to change the world for the better. They reopened that door. And you used your chance to destroy a way of life you did not support. We have seen time and time again what happens when people are left to interpret for themselves. Knowledge must be controlled. Only then can the message be widely understood. No. <laughs> the day where there is but one truth draws nearer. One truth, that is what the Order offers. This one sought to spark a new flame, but did so with a heavy hand. Not a teacher's tongue. This cleansing of yours ends here. My work is incomplete, but not inconsequential. There are others who carry on. For one of the four is us. Why did you say that? What does it mean? Now I go. A flame that grows bright and burns ever more, ever light. To Helheim, where cold and crueler fires await. Zingiborg's involvement. Keep the dog chasing him. That arrow was flying sideways. Oh, that one was too. She was bad from the first time you met her? Yeah, me too. Like, as soon as the, she rolled in, she's like, I'm the Abbess, I'm here to help. I was all like, that's, that's her. I didn't know she was the Firebrand at first until I recognized she had ha red hair. But then I was all like, oh yeah, she's evil. Nope. Sound effect is. Oh that's, my God, I was gonna ask you if you know what it was. that's a new sound effect. I've never heard that before. It's like, is it, is it, it's like a, ch like a twinkling. Is it maybe the thing that's on your? Can't be ignite your weapon after critical hits. Increases critical damage after a finisher, maybe. I don't know. Restore some health on parry. No. Can we hear it every now and then? But I haven't heard it until today. I don't know no, if that's... I, it was their last stream too. Was it? Yeah. Oh. Whoa, whoa. I kept hearing it. I was like, I should ask Matt when I just got lazy. I didn't recognize it last stream. Really? <laughs> Does anybody know what that sound effect is? It's my heart of blood. <laughs> oh, that's dumb. You really get that checked out if you can hear it. Yeah, if, if I can hear it and it sounds like that, we gotta go to the hospital right now. 
Uh, yeah, that's not, that's not normal. <laughs> that's true. I do? Yeah. How am I climbing that wall? That looks, that looks very strange. Hands? That looks very strange. <laughs> It's fine now, because that's just, that's so much better. Oh, were you just wanting to show me that you were upgrading? Yeah. Oh, fudge, dude. Uh, hey, hey, hey. What was it earlier? Was it when I was making breakfast or something, you came to the kitchen to help oh, me? Oh, yeah, it, it was lunch. I just, I just came around the corner, and I was like, hey, and you were like, holy fuck, yeah, dude. Oh, my God. Well, I think I'm a little stressed today. A little? You're on edge. What news do you bring? The Firebrand's flame burns no longer. It was Jorvik's abyss, Inkiborg. Gods, I would never have suspected. Does the mm. Order's reach know no bounds? None. And it is often those we least expect who carry out their ambitions. The abyss sought to destroy all Christian texts in the city. Rid Jorvik of their ideals. She did utter a phrase that perked my ears. One of the four is ours. Four? But there are only three targets in Jorvik. Could there be something we're missing? Damn Picts! Not only do they hold the North, but those lawless six have free roam in our lands as well. Yours said our spies are on the ground. Under the ground. Only one of them has returned, bone-beaten and bloodied. The Howling Mother takes them. Are there four Don't things? Venus, a moment of your time, and here if he's about. I will be with you shortly. Two more left to hunt. The disputes coming out of the docks lately have been deafening. Head there and dig around. Something is bound to turn up. <laughs> okay. Well, now we go to the docks. I'm gonna go ahead and mark that as well. Yeah, I wanna keep an eye on it. They just say underground. You're underground. Okay. Mm -hmm. Or stop whistling. Or at the very least, stop following me. Like, I was running away and his whistle was not getting any quieter. <laughs> very shrill, bro. Cut it out. Tackle Uber Punch thing actually called. Rage of Helheim. God, it looks so much faster on fast forward, too. Happy's leaving. Wares are being kept. See you later, Amos. Thanks for hanging out, dude. The guards here are vigilant. <laughs> Doesn't seem very vigilant. Is well guarded by the Red Hand. The Order has a stake in these docks. It seems like the complaints by the merchants never reached the Council. The 
seized exotic wares. These are worth plenty. Something that could be on the Red Hand's agenda. Accumulating wealth. I expect all the coin from the merchants to be delivered to my office daily. Their stalls draped in black are not hard to find. Do not fail me again. The sting of a needle. I'm on his trail. So, the Dark Master seizes cargo and resells it for the merchants in the marketplace. The ones involved bear black cloths. I may be able to get their attention by showing some silver around the marketplace. I thought you were going to swing at that. I considered it. I'm just kidding. Where's the market? Uh, north. Black Claw. Is that black? Well, there's nobody here, so... Cabocade Market. I'll flash some silver to the merchants. That should get their attention. Trouble at the depot earlier. What do you mean, trouble? I don't know for sure, but the needle is calling for more protection. Meet me here at nightfall. We will go see him together. Those guards will return after dark. I might be able to follow them to the needle. Hi, friend. I have a hoard of silver I'm making to spend. Can you help me? What have you got? I have nothing left to trade, but Coppergate Market is the right place. Ask around. You'll find someone who'll bend an ear. My thanks. Have you any wine for sale? There's nary a drop in town. Shame. I could do with a cup, but the last this feast is the talk of the town. I am eager for it. Good man, that Alden. I hear this marketplace sees its fair share of silver path through. I have something that may interest you. You will want to speak to Grigori. The Dark Master? Sorry. Who are you? Someone who wants to do business with Grigori. I don't know your face, and I've said too much already. Please, go. Psst. Psst. Hey! Did I hear you talking about silver? I'm looking to spend a large sum, not fork it over to some street beggar. Oi! I'm no beggar, you dolt. I'm with the big dogs. You mean the needle? You have something he wants. If you truly want to make a trade, head to the statue near the east gate. I shall. Watch yourself around here, young one. Who, me? <laughs> Please. I have a bigger sword than a lot of them. Gross. He is hidden around the statue. Statue near the east gate. Oh, well, here's the statue. Okay. Final tr uh, small treasure is probably in here. Yeah. Right, you find it before. There's another key over there. There's another key. I am not a key. <laughs> I am the key. What do you have to Is that dumb? Yeah. 
This place is heavily guarded. The sound of metal. A workshop in the sewers. What is the needle's operation? Ooh. All this silverware, some still in their crates. Has this all been seized as well? and coins. What do they plan on doing with it? They're forging money. Counterfeit money making. I'm not surprised to find you creeping down here. You! You don't belong down here! We run a clean dark in Jorvik. I believe those were your words. And yet here I find you swimming in silver from all the wares you've seized. Are you the Needle, or just another of his pawns? You have it all wrong. The fabric of this world has been used up, torn, shredded, you see. Someone must be there to stitch it back together. Someone with a firm yet steady hand, who can thread the Needle. Someone like me. You are a shit poet, but at least my question is answered. <laughs> yes, well, we all have our weaknesses. Yours appears to be the iron between us. Think your men are going to stop me? I would not undermine them so. The Red Hand are loyal to our cause, which is more than I can say for the merchants. Make it quick! Meet me in the marketplace when you are done. Okay. Let me get up? Jesus, fuck. <laughs> For the life of me, I couldn't get off the floor. Just like real life. Oh. I got life alert. I think so. I think we have to go forward.
they're gonna counterfeit money. I'm gonna use it. What the fuck is that? Okay. Something on my mouse pad kept tickling my fingy. It's a gold! That damned background slipped through my fingers. I'll finish this in Coppergate Market. solve my problem, but... I still need to go further forward. Huh. Like slidey pop slidey parts, yeah. That's a good idea. Yeah, look look through the window. Yeah. Oh, interesting. It looks like it we're coming from up above and going down to it. So where you killed that one guard with the arrow, there was no place to slide under there. Let's go look. If not, then maybe it is from the outside somewhere. Yeah. It seems unlikely. It, sh it feels like it should be from in here because you can see the treasure from in here. But I don't think they've shown me a treasure I couldn't reach from the place yet. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like the one that was in the Assassin's Bureau that you were like, how did we get this? And yeah. Slide on the thing. Shoot on God! Son. Sweet, 
Can we turn the sun off for a second? It's way too bright right here. Further left. There's something. <laughs> Kinda. That was the same. It was the lady that kept screaming that same thing over and over again. Shut up! How do I get there? Because I bet you that might be it. It's not going to give us a treasure we can't get to again, so we'll go ahead and continue this, and if we have to, we'll double back later, now that we know how to get into this place, if, if we need to come back. Looks like we need to get inside this building. Crap, that's not what I wanted. Come, come, walk with me. It is good to walk. <laughs> Gregory. Good to take in the air. The sights, the sounds, the smells. Please, Gregory, I, 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 I didn't think you'd mind. It was just a few coins. Shh, shh, shh. I understand. It's not your fault. It was mine, for thinking you had anything but empty air between your ears. With all the silver I've given you, I have nothing left to feed my children, let alone myself. Please, understand. Oh, dear God. Merchants of Jorvik, I promised you a future rife with opportunity. And what was the one thing I asked in return? Do you remember? Loyalty. LOYALTY! Let this serve as a lesson. Should any of you think it a good idea to threaten my operation? They will attack on the side here. I do the thinking. You do as you do. Child, I thought of snow as the tears of God, frozen by our sins. Wow, that's dark. Weak with hunger, I stared into the sky, hoping it was me he wept for. Me, he sought to save. But God did not save me. The vault did. He took me to a fine house, gave me hearty meals, a warm bed. For the first time, someone extended a hand. Showed me kindness, compassion. And it was then that I made a vow. I vowed to never turn my back on he who was there for me when God was not. So you served the bolt, knowing full well what he was a part of. The Order made our paths intersect. I owed them a debt, and I repaid it by saving this city from its own destruction. A life debt is a strong motivator. It took hold of this one's hugot, drove it, and never let go. Yet not with the same compassion you were shown. Too many have suffered by your hand in pursuit of this course. You're right. Perhaps I deserve this death. But I am but one cog in a large wheel. One 
that still turns unhindered. Not for long. Where you have gone, there will be no tears waiting for you. Damn, that's dark. <laughs> Killed the chicken. That was my experience, you jerk. Yeah. Follow my lead. Place, Deb. All right, bye. Gotta go. <laughs> yeah, hi, Step. Bye. <laughs> Dead and just standing up? Oh, hey, there's a dead body in your market, in your stall. Sorry about that. Hey, puppy. I love you. He said hi. Hey, puppy. Bark. That means he loves me too. I 
don't think you can get it. <laughs> I guess it's time to just on fire again. Yeah, dude. I'm down. Wait a second. Was there an entrance going down in the trade depot? I guess they came to an agreement. That's where I came from. Pretty eyes. Give me a hug. <laughs> Yay! Oh, the other puppy wants in on it. wasn't really awkward. <laughs> There's a pole there, but don't jump to it. I felt, as I was running by that guy, I felt like the Yes. Yes. Yeah, that's what I thought. With the chainsaw. <laughs> The needle will never sting again. Well done, Neivor. Who was hiding behind the name? My love, there has been an attack at the markets. The dockmaster, Grigory, is dead. The needle. Sold off the wares he seized to collect silver for the vault. He had no such authority. Why would anyone believe him? 
The Council Seal. That rat. This is getting out of hand. How he was able to obtain this is concerning. I must return and prepare for the Yuletide Feast, but I will do so with a bent ear and a keen eye. Be safe. A valuable seal. And a riddle. One of the four is ours. One of the four. Rizie, Falavith, Odin, and... You're the four members of the Council. We should search their offices now, while they're occupied with the Yuletide Feast. Yes. Yes. Come, to the Archives. Could I have missed something? We will find out soon enough. I think it's all doing. No, it wouldn't be all doing. Because he had no idea about the uh, the redhead lady. I think it's the skinnier dude that was complaining to the chubbier guy that has a shield on his back. That makes sense. The guy with the beard. Wow, I'm nailing descriptive terms. I don't know what that guy's name is. That is where the councilmen confer. A list. What Jorvik needs for the Yuletide feast. That is Aldon's handwriting. Items have been struck out. Where did he find the funds to make this larger purchase? Aldon is a well connected man. I have seen these weapons and supplies. Enough for a small group of fighters. Hardly enough for Haftan's army. Could be why Faravith is pressing the council for more silver. <laughs> this desk. It looks as though it's been moved here. That's yours, desk. It is loaded with silver. Scratch marks on the floor. Your desk used to be against the other wall. So why the change? A hidden entrance. Where does this lead? Guard the door. wine here. Whoever moved it did so in a hurry. A load of wine was removed from here, and the room smells of almonds. It may be the wine was poisoned. It is likely the wine for the Yuletide feast. Do you think one of the council means to kill someone? It looks that way. It is not him, not Mayor. He would never do this. He... Keep your focus. Once we have all the facts, then we can worry about Hyor. Right now we need to get to the Yuletide Feast. The people are in danger. You're right. The Roman Amphitheatre. Let us go. Do you see the wine? No. Then there's still time. The entire council is here. Any one of them could be the vault. I need you to keep an eye out for the wine. 
I will speak to each of the council members, see if I can trap them in a lie. Even Hjor? Even Hjor. If he is the Vault, I will not allow him to kill all these people. Lufina. I heard you. Just grant me one thing. Confer with me before you make your move. I will. I found the location. I also found the location for the three keys. Best. It's like you never find them. Oh, uh, okay. But I know what to do with the other. Where? Do I go back into the sewer? Where the chest marker is, just east of that, outside the city walls near the bridge, is a cave entrance. What the fuck? It's the same with the three chests. You probably would never. So it's like over here. Oh no, it's right here. Yeah. Look over there. You okay, let's go. Back. Let's go. Thank you. And then we'll worry about the three keys later. Yeah. But you're not gonna find those either. All right, let's. I would have expected the entrance to be in the city. That's what everyone was talking about. They were like, "What about this one near the trade market?" They're like, "I can't find it." <laughs> They're like, "Yeah, go outside." Yeah, it's not in the city, and you're like, "But this whole place is solely about the city." <laughs> that's what. That's what threw me through the through a loop. Is I was like, I I never would have looked on the outside of the walls. I would have just assumed it was locked somewhere and I couldn't get it. Thank you, Cappy. Yeah, that was my first thing. Do I need to go back into the sewers? No. Well, shit. <laughs> That's why I said the, the other ones I won't lead you to the direct location, but I'll be like in Give me hints. Yeah, like in this area. Okay. okay. That's fine. I'll, yeah, I'll yeah. I'm cool with that. This one I just couldn't give you a hint as to. Yeah, I never would have come here. Are you kidding me? And yeah, this just screams what I was looking at. Yeah. Oh, there it is. I just... <laughs> I guess we expected you to just know to do that. Anyways. At least I that's out of the way. Thank you. No, no, no. Speak with the suspects. So, Cure was. Cure knew that he was sending silver to the markets to be melted down. <laughs> we know that. Uh, and he was trying to hide it from his wife. Uh, Cure also moved his desk. Well, we don't know if he moved it. So I guess someone else could have moved his desk. It is possible that Hyor's like, No, I was sending silver to the market to get melted down to make my wife a ring or something. <laughs> there could be, but... It sure looks suspicious at the moment. Where the hell is the... the theater, there we go. Jeez. This area is off limits. What did Odun do? Oh, the one guy needed a lot of silver to buy more weaponry, and Odun needed a bunch of silver to buy a lot of stuff for the festival. Yeah, food. Yeah, really expensive foods and wines and yeah. carpets and stuff. They all wanted a lot of money. And it was a whole figure it out. Yeah. So I think it's mainly just talk to the people, catch them in lies, and then make a decision. Now to speak to the council members. I will speak of the wine and watch for their reactions. That may lead me to the vault. Rishi. Ah, 
Come to join the feast, have you? I have some bad news. The wine for the feast has spoiled. Of course it has. Why would I expect differently? I'll have my men dump it. There may be more wine in my private stores. I'll send a man to retrieve it. Is there anything else? That is all. Enjoy the feast. I shall try. Highly unlikely it's him. He's cool with just dumping all the wine. I'll have the silver ready in the coming days. Thank you, Bob. Of course. What a delightful feast! Alden has outdone himself. Alden, it seems you have found the funds to go ahead with the feast after all. You must be elated. <laughs> that is putting it lightly. Look at it! I could not have asked for a better turnout. Soon the feast will begin. And these people will be given everything they deserve. We should honor you. I will fetch us some wine. Uh, no, no, no. I, I mustn't indulge. Uh, the wine is for the people of Jorvik. Uh, but when it arrives, do help yourself. Odin has outdone himself. Uh-huh. He has indeed. <laughs> The High Reeve of Jorvik has a bright future ahead if he keeps this up. Faravid, a word if I may. Ah, Drenger. If it's to join arms with me, the answer is yes. We can use someone like you against the Picts. I may be courted, but I'm selective with whom I join. Are you a drinker? Ha! Ah, if that is a challenge, I am up for it. Very well. I'll return with some wine. Wine? <laughs> Come now, we will do this over ale. That will give us a good measure of who can better fight its lure. That doesn't say much, though, because he's a fellow horse. Yeah. Hjor, who was that? There you are. I was beginning to worry. Worry not. We have tracked the vault here. He's someone on the council. You are certain? I am. Once I discover who, I will dig my blade into his heart and end this for good. Until then, it is important that I investigate without raising suspicion. I need your help. Of course. What do you need me to do? Drink yourself into a drunken fit. What? Why? I need a distraction. Keep their eyes off of me. The wine should arrive soon. Drink three full cups, then make a scene. I can't be seen doing that. You'll have to find another way. Just do it. Eivor, have you uncovered who the vault is? I believe I have. Each of the council members has given me reason to suspect them. Some more than others. Who is it you suspect? That's right. Alvin was the one pushing for the feast from the start. He planned it, which means he would have had access to the wine. And he was helping Abbas Ingibor collect Christian texts. She turned out to be the firebrand. Yes. Yes, you're right. And the wine? Of all the councilmen, he knew the wine had not yet arrived. When I offered some, he flat out refused, insisting it be saved for the guests. For these reasons, I think Audun is the vault. Brothers, sisters, dear friends, welcome all. Before we begin, I would like to introduce our honored guests. Here with me are some of Jorvik's most revered lords. Men and women who have kept Jorvik trudging through these harsh times. I am pleased to say that today, on today, we honor you. We honor as well the nobles to whom we are all so The wine. Aldun is the vote. Too late for them. We must not miss our chance. Join me now in celebrating their successes and yours. To everything you deserve and to more. Shit. And now... Deafened and blinded by 
lust for indulgence. Your foolish pride. I will tell you just what nobility is. A death sentence. A new world of order is upon us. A pity none of you will live to see it. Get the councilmen to safety. I will handle all of them. Go. I guess that's a good way if you if you miss miss uh, associate someone that the game lets you get away with it with making a mistake without punishing you too bad. 